People are using apps less and less. Like I install an app maybe once every three months. The market isn't as much of a gold rush as it once was. If you're gonna build an app, make it really sweet. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> make sweet apps. There's a less obvious shift that's, that's probably more important that's happening within the, within the mobile platforms and that's concurrency. On the face of it, they're fairly straightforward, you know, just adding async async a weight to the languages that we should have had for ages, but there's a lot more to it than that if you look at what they're trying to accomplish. That's an area, I guess, where we should all be investing time and effort and trying to learn how to use it effectively. Just to add to that, I think it's important to not do that on the home screen of your app. Learn and figure those out, not in the production app. Yeah, but this, I'm not speaking from experience. <laughs> There's definitely a trend towards uh, full stack development. I pick a tool that allows you to try those different domains, see where your strengths and weaknesses are, and experiment with working across those different domains. I hate the phrase full stack. I just want to put that out there. <laughs>